Good morning, farmers. Welcome to another episode of Harvest Moon. Last episode, we performed the Song of Storms on the Ocarina of Time at the church with Vampire Carter and his evil plot to stop me from getting my frying pan. Sorry. But yes, and we're training little Tommy to uh, scare him off because he is a. He's now a battle hound, little Tommy. Right, anyway, so we need to train as well. We need to get, give him his ball as well to let him see if he can bring it back. So he increases his intelligence. Bring it to me. Clever girl. And back. And back, please. Have I mentioned that he looks like a frog when he's jumping? Oi! He's like, no, nah, I'm done for today. You, you fetch it yourself. No, no, he's going to get it. It's fine. Yeah, he looks like a little bit like a frog. Which, um, considering our arch nemesis is the frog king, it's not that, it's not best, really. Or maybe he's not our arch nemesis. Maybe he's just an enemy of ours. Anyway, TV time. We should have done that first, but I didn't. Okay. Directional buttons up, down, left, right. Do the hokey pokey and turn around. The shogi hour. Oh, no. Don't like that. Here's to Mother's weather forecast. It'll be a wonderful, crisp and clear fall day. I didn't change the channel. I just I just watched the same one. Right. Shouldn't This shouldn't be, this should be new because we did a thing today. Yes. Day 4 of 4. This month's events are 9th Harvest Festival, 13th Moon Viewing Day, 21st Sheep Festival. That's it. Time for life on a farm with Farmer Fran and Jimmy. Farmer Fran, Farmer Fran. Yes, Jimmy. That postbox near my house isn't just for decoration. Well, of course not. You should check for mail often because you receive notices when new products come into the shops and when events are going to happen in the village. Oh, the letters that you don't sad read disappear after one month, so be careful. Then you should check the postbox every day. I think I, I think I might have missed some of the first month then. The Shogi Hour. Today we continue with the game played between a hundred bank down player and the first player and the hundred one deck player and the second player. Second five six poor first six four poor second six six poor seven four poor seven six poor eight four poor eight six poor nine four poor nine six poor. We'll end here for today and continue with the next game next time. No, please don't. Ugh, ugh, ugh. What about that end? I don't care. Anyway, let's do Farmer's Journal begin. This is the fourth of fall. It is Sunday, it is 6 o'clock in the morning if you wanted to know, and it is year one, and it is sunny outside. Much to my distress. Uh, today it is the 4th, like I said, and there is nothing to do, so that is it. Shall we continue on with it? We shall continue on with it. Farewell, Tommy, I'm off to do some work on the farm. Right, so what's the plan for today then? Fish, probably. Get the fishing done. Oh, look, it's the all seen sparrows! That means today is going to be a good day. Because they foresee the future. Let's go and see each sirloin then. Oh, I love them. I miss them, guys. Uh, it does mean that there's no chickens, though. Which is a shame. All right, let's get my brush. There it is. Brush sirloin. There, there, sirloin. You look happy today. <laughs> oh, I nearly did the old um, shadow text instead. Right, let's get this. And mosey on out of town. Let's go. I suppose it's an interesting topic to talk about. Just fill some time. What would I like to add to this game? Like, I could go on saying about like a new generation one where it could be ma where it'd be like a massive thing, if you know what I mean, like a massive world. But let's think about it more logically. There, there, Shadow, grow up fast. Like, say if I can, I'm not, I'm not going to. Oh, I can't whistle while I'm holding a basket. There we go. Hey, yeah, there he is. <laughs> I was going to say, your training's not doing very well. Yeah. So, for example, if I could release a DLC thing for this game, what would I like it to include? Oh, look at this. They're sprouting. They're, the sweet potatoes are sprouting. Good. Uh, yeah, what would I like to add? I would love to have some sort of bakery. I don't know what purpose it would serve. I'm just trying to think. Like, I suppose you could buy bread there instead of at the ba instead of at the shop. But then I don't see what the purpose would that be. It wouldn't really have much of a purpose, would it? Um, perhaps more animals. No, more animals. What animals would I like? Uh, as chickens. And they have laid eggs. Good. What animals would like to add? This is a good question. Um, ducks are always nice, although they wouldn't really serve much of a purpose either. Um, ooh. A cat. I would like to be able to have a cat for the house. <gasps> no, but, uh, like I always say, uh, like some sort of collecting thing, like you can collect bugs or photos. No, photos! That was it. That's what I said ages ago. That would be a perfect thing. It'll give a, it would give a Having be able to take photos and have like a scrapbook where you could have to fill it up or you have to take pictures of chickens and you have to take pictures of uh, cows and stuff. That would be perfect because it would give you something to do when there's nothing else to do. Yeah, you listen with me. And you know the photographer, the ca I think he's called Cano, which I think is like a play on Canon. 
pepper to, I'm not sure. Yes, that would give a purpose to him because he would teach you about all this stuff and he would give you the camera and he would like assess your scrapbooking stuff and that. Yes, that would be perfect addition to have. So I'll add that as a feature. I'll add some animals. What animals can we do? I like to have a cat for the house because there is cats in the game so that would be an easy one to do. And something else. Um, I'm not sure. I don't need to put anything in there. I will have a think while I'm walking around doing all the foraging, and then I will see you later for some more stuff. Yes, I think next time I'll see you, I will be doing some fishing, yes. Unless something happens in town. I have a feeling something's going to happen in here, so if I get my stuff ready. So this wild grape obviously goes to Lelilia. So if I give that to you, Lilia, I think she will. Wait, no, she doesn't. Oh, that's great at all. Well, there's no point in me doing this thing at all, is there, then? Not to be the waste of... Uh... Video. Well, hello. I seldom go out because I'm frail, so we have little opportunity to meet, don't we? No, because whenever I need chicken feed, I come and talk to you. All right, that was a waste of time. Right, so I've done all the watering. I've just popped off the farm so I could sort of reload as a black screen. And I want to do something before we go. I want to check the mail that we didn't do this morning. I said I was going to check it, but well, I thought I was going to say it, but I didn't. If you'd have adult cows and you don't have a milker, I recommend you buy one. Say, borrow the breakfast. We will close at 5pm on day 5 of this month. Doug from Doug's Place. Ah, oh, that's what the pub is called then. Doug's Place. That sounds a terrible name. You could have called it anything. The Drunken Cow. The Hyper Chicken. <laughs> or the Stuffed Cow. I mean, the Stuffed Sheep. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know. The Sheep's Head. No, that seems even worse. <sighs> the Horse Place. Go with that. That <laughs> sounds terrible. Uh, yeah, okay, why is he closing early on Thursday? I'll have to check that out. Nothing has come. Good, right, okay. Now it is time to go do some fishing. It's a new video, so I can keep it in. And we're going to get it done. I need eight more, is it? Uh, yes, it is. Eight more. I want to try and get nine more, though, so I can... What's the word? So I can sort of... Make sure I definitely have enough. Like, I know it's 50, but I'd like to get 51, just to be sure. And then we can end fishing. Oh, of course, we do need to sell as well, though. I've only got... Um, I've only got 10 I've sold because I sold them last month. So we'll have to try and get the rest of those. Right. Oh no, I'm going to have the music all night as well now. Go says, Oh my god, what is that? What are you? Hey, little fella. How's it going? Oh, li oh, look, so oh look at him. Look at him. Don't go away. Oh, look at you. What are you? You're a fox. Oh my god, you've got a bushy tail. Oh, you are so Cute, it's a look, look at it. Oh, cool, buddy. Oh, look at him, he's so cute. Oh, he's getting a drink. Oh, he's getting a little twinkie. Oh, he's so cool. He's so funny. I like him. He needs a name. Oh, look at him. <gasps> Can I have that as a pet? That is amazing. That is just cute. I've got a dead fish. Oh, look at him. Oh, I wish we called it for him. Oh, look at him. He's so happy. He's so happy up here on the mountain. I don't want to go for like the generic foxy. I don't know. I don't want to go for that. He's got a bushy tail. He's all prancy. He's happy. Oh, he's, he actually is getting a drink. That is fantastic. Oh, wow. That's made my day. I don't know what to call him. Oh, he's getting a drink. Oh... That's so cool. I have no idea what to call a fox. I don't think I'm ever going to see him again either, so I'm a bit sad that I'm never going to see him again. Hopefully I will. Should we try and find some sort of fox terms? Fox! Let's see if we can... So this is how I do stuff. I look. I Google. I Google the Googles to find things. Oh, it's not loading up. Look at him, he's just drinking away. He drinks a lot, doesn't he? Oh, look at him. Right, nothing. Okay, go for the next one. Can't believe that. Wow, why is my computer so slow? I suppose I am recording both audio and stuff. There's 12 species of foxes. Oh, he, he's like La Volpe from, uh, what's it called? Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Oh, look at him. Oh, look at him. He's so cool. He's jumping around. I feel like I want to call him Prancy. Prancer. No. Fish. Dead one. Wow, no fish at all. Oh, he's so cool. What do I call him? What do I call him? Oh! Darwin's box. 
Island fox. Fish. Ah, little worker fish. Fantastic. I don't know what to call him. I honestly don't know. I don't want to force a name. No, no, no fishy. Alright, I guess we'll leave the name then. Wait, what, why does Vix ring a bell? Vix. Is that a name of a fox I don't know about? <gasps> oh, it is! Oh, no. Ah, damn fish. Fish are eluding me today, f little, little foxy. Oh, it is. Vix. Vix is a baby snow fox that can be achieved as an adopted pet in Elder Scrolls. Five, Skyrim. I like. I like Vix because it's a bit like Vol Volpix. Obviously, it's missing the middle letters. So could I? Could I call it Vix? Could I actually call it that? Lord of the Dance. Lord of the Meadows. Meadow Dancer. I don't know. Ah, oh, this is all this thing is trying to think of a name for a fox. Gotcha. Ah, another one. That's two. I need four, ideal, if I can. <laughs> it reminds me of Alex from uh, Madagascar. That's a tin can. You know, where it's like all dancing around is like. It's like a dance. It's not really like a proper f line, if you know what I mean. It's Vix. No, not called Vix. In fact, Vix is already taken. I want to call him Vix, though. That's a cool name. Maybe we should call him Lord of the Lord of the Mountain or Lord of the Lord of the Meadow. I feel that's a nice name. He hasn't got a name. Mr. Fox, Lord of the Meadows. How many how many have I got? How many fish have I got? I wanna get four. I've gotta go sit down. Oh, I'm gonna have to keep up. Oh. oh I need one more. Come on, you can get one more. You get one more guys. Come on. Come on. Come on, fish. Lord of the Meadow, bring me a fish. It's a branch. Close enough. Not close. Yeah, not quite close enough. Look at him prancing around. He's like, yeah. I'm the Lord of this meadow. Oh, come on, fishies. I can't. I've got to go back. I've got to head back. Five, four, three, two, one. I've got to go. I've got to go. Oh, damn it. We've got to go. Goodbye, Lord of the Meadows. I'll take you with me. <laughs> Come on, my lord. We must travel back home. To the place where we go. I didn't do my run back, so I forgot. But uh, yeah, yeah. Sadly, we had to leave. We had to leave Lord of the Meadows up on uh, on the mountain side. But oh well. But anyway, make diary entry and sleep, shall we? Okay, dear diary. Today we met the Lord of the Meadows, or the Meadow, from Farmer JD. Welcome, farmers, to another morning. Right, yesterday was quite an eventful day. We had the Lord, we had the Lord of the Shadow Meadows. Shadows, not the shadows. All fairy me today. That's good. Here's to Mother's weather forecast. It will be a wonderfully crisp and clear fall day. The news is probably the same as it always been. Day five, some months. Yeah, it was fine. Life on the farm. Farmer friend, farmer friend. Yes, Jimmy. The village is so large that I still get lost sometimes when you lose your way. Just witness the select button to view a map of the entire village and to see your current position, right? This is a good way to gradually learn the whole lay of the land. Oh, okay. This is also useful when your dog is missing. I can find where my dog is. That's great. <laughs> that was voices were completely mucked up, but oh well. Now it's time for the Mary and me. This story. Ha, uh, his story. <laughs> Chapter 8. I changed my shoes and went outside. I hadn't realized it had begun to snow. It reminded me of the first time I met Crystal. I was a snowy day like this. On that day, I heard a sound from the park on my way home from school. I wondered what it was. I found a white puppy inside the box. I felt sorry for it, but my apartment doesn't allow pets, so I couldn't take it home. I thought the least I could do was feed it something, so I went to the convenience store and brought her some milk. When I got back, a girl was standing beside the box. That girl was Crystal Wintermouth. Month. Winter month. To be continued. Oh, it is interesting. It is a tale of love and loss and passion. Isn't that right, Tom? Yeah, sure is, boss. That's right, my little warhound. Hound of war, dogs of war. 
Kennel Master. <laughs> we, need, we need a Kennel Master. Right, yeah, we ain't got really out of fish yet, so we'll go do that later, but it's alright for now. Right, go get it! It's not there, it's over there. Past the garden. Good, bring it to me. Bring it to me. Thank you, boss. Go fetch. Bring it back. Over here, please. Over here. Woof. Indeed. Thank you. Good. Good lad. Right, okay. Put this in here. And then we'll do Farmer's Journal. Beep. Okay, right. Let's get my tools ready for the day. There we go. Okay, Farmer's Journal begin. It is the 5th of fall. It is Monday. It is 6 o'clock in the morning if you wanted to know. And the weather outside is fair. It is also year one. So today, we're going to try and visit Doug to find out why he's closed early today. And I feel like 3 o'clock will be a good time. So we'll do that later. Right, okay, it's done. That's it though. That's pretty much it. There's nothing, not much to do. Are we going to have to say good morning to someone today? Are we? Good morning, Captain Cluck. How are you today, your Cap Cluck? Short for Captain Cluck. Right, let's take a sip of tea, actually. Mm -hmm. Scrumptious. Right, let's move you. Let's move you, big cow butt. There we go. Brush. Talk. There, there, Saloon. You look happy today. Didn't look very happy. He didn't really pull a face. He just, like, you know, just, just blanked face. Blank face. Which is fine, you know, I suppose. Oh, I suppose. Right, let's go and check on the... No, don't put your basket down there. You've got to go check on your shadow horse first. I can't wait until the horse is grown. I'll be able to ride it. It'll be a much bigger part of the channel. I mean, this place. The farm. Twin Tree Farm. Pick up that. And run. I didn't do exercise today. You'll be fine. You did a little bit this morning. Uh, plants are looking good as well. They're still growing. Yeah, the weeds are still growing as well. We'll have to sort of, once we've finished all the uh, planting, we'll have to. One, two, three. Yeah, we'll have to start. Once we've done all the fishing, so we're not planting, uh, we'll have to work on clearing up the farm and take it back from the wild people. The wild side will, is taking over, trying to take over my thing. Not for much longer, it won't. Right, good morning, chickens. Did I feed you yesterday? I, I did think I did, but just to make sure. I did, good. That's perfect. Drop the stuff in here. Apple. 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 And I already dropped my thing in there. Okay, so there's three over this side. If I take one. There we go. Take that one. Uh, yes, and again, uh, I'm not doing this other chicken yet. Because there is obviously one space for one more chicken. I'm not doing it yet until we get an event. Which I believe happens this month sometime. I'm not sure when. Uh, we'll have, a f have to find out when. But yeah. I believe it actually belongs to... No, it belongs to Horia. Not 40k right, man. Horia has the last chicken. So there's, obviously there is no more spaces left because Horia's only got... Unless you haven't had one. If you haven't had one, you can get a chicken. But if you have had a chicken... If you haven't had a, if you have had a chicken, you can't get another one because Horia is... If if, it's, if no one else that hasn't had a chicken claims one, Horia will automatically get this one. Because uh, that's how it works. But if you haven't had a chicken, then you can get a chicken. But I'm pretty sure no one will say they haven't had one yet. But yeah, that will happen sometime, sometime this season. This I think we finished this, this week on... Day nine, nine. So um, sometime after then. I'm not sure when. But that's when you'll have your chicken. F Mr. Hodia. And then we've also got cows coming up as well. We'll have to get. So that's cows you can get names of. Got plenty of names for cows. Everyone's already... Well, the list is already full. But that's filled up with like five... F five of my... Well, not five of my chickens. It's more like three. Three of my cows. Three of 40k warrior man's cows. And the rest have one cow. So if you want a cow, you only have to ask. Right, okay, good. All right, then, I'm going to go do some foraging. I shall see you probably at 3 o'clock where we go and try and find Doug, see where he is. It's typical. Whenever I don't prepare myself, like, I usually, as I come into a place, I'm like, oh, I'm going to talk just in case they say something interesting. The day I don't do it, something happens. Here we go. Anyway. I know. I'll teach you how to cook scrambled eggs. It's very easy, so you should try it. Just heat oil in a frying pan, which I can't get because of the me vampire. Vampire. Ruined my plans. And my pan. Then add in the eggs and mix them around. That's the basic recipe, but you can whisk the eggs in a bowl with salt and soy sauce and sugar first. You can add butter or mayonnaise. Kids like that, though it may sound weird. Eggs give you energy, so we eat them three times a day. Maybe that's why my children are so boisterous. Are they boisterous? I did not know they were. 
Oh, hello, JD. Do you need something? I do not, I don't think. Anyway, no, I don't think I do. Right, um, I'll just get out of this and then I'll cut away the video as we walk out because I like to use the, the fade. It's a black that they do in the game. I like to use that as a transition. Like this. Time for today's only Farmer's Journal event. It's uh, time to go and f talk to Doug and find out why he's closing early today. Uh, I've heard from the rumours around the village that he's up here. So we're going to find out on Mother's Peak Peak. Oh, Mother's Hill Peak. That's it. Not Mother's Peak Peak. Mother's Peak Peak. Right, hello! Hello! Ah, aha, there you are. Hello, Doug. Let's go stand in front of him, though. So he will continue to look out beyond the stars. Hello, sir. Today is the anniversary of Anne's mother's death. On this one day, Anne always lets me rest. I'm thankful to her for that. Anne's in control of you. Today I should think only of me dear departed wife. Indeed you should. Hasn't water. <laughs> My condolences. I didn't have any flowers, so you know. It's cool up here. See, all the clouds are moving as well. I didn't notice. Eh, interesting. Anyway, I'm going because it's boring up here. Absolutely livid. I spent a long time fishing and I got nothing. I got a few branches, a broken can and a few boots. And that's all I got. So no fish whatsoever. That is outrageous. I can't... Oh, so angry. I wanted to get I wanted to get 50 today. I didn't. Curse to all of you. I say goodnight and sleep tight, you fools. Not you. I mean the fishing. Dear diary, today we got no fish from Farmer JD. Good morning, farmers. After that horrible night last night, we're getting no fish. Those curses. The, the, the delicious hour. Here's to mother's weather forecast. Rain from the morning and a little chilly. I didn't change the channel. I'm not going to check the news. because Oh, it might be. No, the news is not going to be the same. It's going to be the same as of all time. Left on a farm. Farm, a friend, farm, a friend, farm, a friend. Yes, Jimmy. Can I buy back a cow after I've sold it? Unfortunately, no. From your question, I take it you sold your cow. Why did you do that? I didn't have enough money for fall seeds, so... I see, but no matter. The reason you cannot buy back an animal that you have sold. I didn't know that. And it was producing G-sized milk. Well, you just have to start over again with a new cow. Yeah, okay, I understand. Now it's Tuesday. If it's Tuesday, then it's time for the delicious hour. If it's a cooking program, I am your host. And now, ooh, introduce a new dish. Every week of today's dish is grape jam. Ingredients, wild grapes, you can add also a little wine and honey if you like, utensils, pot, seasoning, sugar, ton 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 ding, finished, let's give it a taste, much 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 much, mmm, delicious, see you next week, bye Naru, miss ya birdie, my cooking friend, anyway, go down there you, come over here to me, to me, to me boy, there we go, that'll work, let's do it again just to make sure, come here, then again this just does, I don't think it does anything, I just think I do that for fun, alright, open up the cabinet, Let's get my ball out ready. Fetch boy! Bring to me boy! Where is he going? Perfect. I won't do it again because I know that you do that perfectly. Perfect. Let's put that away and we'll do Farmer's Journal. Okay, Farmer's Journal. Oh, sorry, I wasn't talking. <laughs> farmer's Journal, begin. It is the 6th of 4. It is Tuesday. It is 6 o'clock in the morning if you wanted to know. The weather outside is fair and it is year 1. So today, the 6th, we should have a sweet potato harvest. So we'll harvest that and that'll be fun. Right, is everyone ready? Good, let's continue to go then. Let's go, let's go. Take care of the animals. Let's go on. What are, what are the plants later? You don't see that though. I'll cut that out. Good morning, Flappy. How are you this fine day? That's, that's my sister's chicken, that is. Flappy. I don't know why she chose to call it Flappy. I guess it's because it's Flappy. I guess. Come on, move your butt. So do I went. You may be a bovine, but you are not a bovine beastie. <laughs> you are a bovine beastie. Right, okay, and I need to brush you and talk to you. I apologise. You know what we haven't looked at yet? We haven't looked at this. So loin. No, that's good. You still got one heart. That means... That means... There we go. They're there, there Sir You look happy today. Yeah. It means it didn't lose, reduce any hearts. If you hit them with tools, they do go mad. They go like... I tried that once before. Uh, yes, so it didn't go down. So I assume... And he didn't make the noise either, so I assume it didn't actually hit him, which is good. Sorry, Sir Loin. My knight. I apologise. Right, let's go and check out on Shadow. Say hello to him. Did I do Farmer's Journal? I did do Farmer's Journal, didn't I? What did I... 
What are we doing? Sweet potato harvest, oh yeah. I thought I was going to buy something today. Talk to you. There, there, Shadow. Grow up fast. Perfect. Okay, good. Let's go. Let's continue to go. Let's do it. Look at all these. I don't know why they're purple. I don't know if sweet potato is purple in real life. Is this real life? Let's take that. And that. And that. And an apple as well. I don't know what this episode is going to be called. I usually like to try and do something that's linked to what happens actually actually happens like throughout the episode. Like today we've done a lot of fishing. I was hoping I was gonna get the fishing roll, I was gonna call it something to do with the fishing roll, but no, because we didn't get it. Um Can we call it anything to do with the, the harvest? I don't suppose we can do it with something to do with the harvest, no, because we won't be probably won't be back by the time that happens. Um So what can we call it instead then? I suppose maybe something to do with the Lord of the Meadow. Because we didn't really do anything interesting apart from fishing. Fall fishing? Mm, nah, I'm not sure. Maybe something along the lines of something to do with fall fishing or... Or something to do with Lord of the Meadow. Maybe. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Anyway, let's just feed the chickens and then we'll get on, get on out of here and we'll go and do some foraging and harvesting and stuff. You know what it is. You know what we do. You know how the world works. Okay, let's put this down here. Place. 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 There we go. Alright. What else have we done? We've done anything interesting at all today. We haven't, have we? I suppose the fox is the most interesting thing that has happened today, so... Maybe we won't call it Lord of the Meadow. Maybe we... Or maybe we could. Although I would like it so it says like a fox, so you know we need, we need a fox. Mmm. These things, I don't get them. It's so difficult to make things. Anyway, I'm going to go forage now. See you soon. Oh, sorry, I didn't realise. <laughs> I always do that. Walk straight in without even saying hello. Right. So, like I said, it's been a pretty dead week, really. I mean, we've got these sort of, sort of I don't know, kite-type style sweet potatoes that are purple. Sounds interesting, doesn't it? Uh, yes, but what else have we done? Um... A lot of fishing. We've met the Lord of the Meadow. And what else? I suppose maybe we can sort of combine the two. Like, that's what I did with one of the Assassin's Creed episodes. Was the title. Because that's a new thing I'm trying to do. I'm trying to sort of name the titles of the videos. Uh, usually with my normal sort of stuff. But uh, with something that's happened in the actual episode. So, for, say for example, uh, this would be like fishing. Because we did a lot of fishing. But I want it to be more exciting than just fishing. So maybe we can combine fishing and a fox. So, fishing with a fox... I like that one. I think we're going to do that one. Is it too long? No. I like to try and keep them small as well because for some reason, my titles, they sort of go off the screen so you can't see them. Whereas other people's titles, when they're long, they just go onto like a second line. Mine do not do that and I have no idea why. It's annoying, but it happens, I guess, so I'll have to deal with it. Yeah, but I don't, I'm not sure why. So, you know, I don't know. So I try to keep them small because the title of this episode, isn't the, the title of this game is quite long. Like Harvest Moon Back to Nature, that's like it's five characters that is. It's very long. Uh yes, so what I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Fishing with a fox. Cause uh, yeah, I'll go with that. Fishing with a fox. I think that's what I'll call it. And that right, Zach, what do you think by the name? Think it's good? I'll take the badges in a bit. Okay, you do that. Okay. In fact we do get a lot of money from this sweet potato. I think we get Whoa! Fifty five thousand. We're crazy in the money. We're rolling in the deep. Let's put that in there then. Ugh. Ugh. Probably have to stop harvesting. Or maybe, maybe we'll finish harvesting by the time this video ends. I need to do some fishing as well if I've got time. Although, technically, I can't put the, all 50 fish in today. Because if I do it then, the event won't happen tomorrow because it's raining. So we'll just have to see how that goes on. Right, but this, this audio file, because the... The way I record, I record audio. Actually, hold on a sec. Let's just make sure it's not full yet. Oh, it's, got, it's only got 11 in. Yeah, that's fine then. We can put these in. It's fine. Yeah, the way I record, I record the video. Obviously, I have to cut that up into the, the video into 20 minute segments. But the audio is a full, full recorded of what I've recorded. And so far, it's at 1 hour 15 minutes, which is rather long. Usually, about an hour is the max. 
but obviously in this case, I don't want to get too many. Um, in this case, something weather. Uh, it's gone over because I don't know why. Probably because we haven't done much. So most of the stuff I've recorded, I won't be able to use. It's boring. All right, guys, should we just let's finish off this one. We've got enough room. So four, five, six, seven, and then this last eight, and then nine. Per perfect. So that'll be nearly a full basket, but we won't lose any crops, which is good because we won't lose any profit. He says. Just waiting for that text to come up saying, Ew, the basket is full, you've lost your crop. And I'll be like, No! My precious sweet potatoes! What am I gonna do for my dinner? Sweet potatoes! Okay, good. Is it three left? It's only two left now, so that'd be good. Let's get this done then. And then finish off. This will be probably the last thing we'll do today, so. After this, you can probably see some uh, fishing next. No, not fishing. I've got to water the crops. So I'll water the crops, and if it's. Depending on the time, I'll probably go straight to bed and I'll just fish tomorrow. Or get a few fish today. I might get a few fish today then if I've got time. Maybe just the bottom thing down here. Yeah, I'll do that. But I won't keep it in because I'll keep it tomorrow's fishing in. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds about right. Okay, let's get rid of this. And that one. And that one. And then we'll take this down to here. I think we've got it all. I'll double check when I water, but I think I did. Okay, and in you go. In you go. In you go. In you go, in you go, one more, one more, let's take this, and let's dump it all in here, perfect, okay, I'm going to water, see you soon.